Greetings, everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Plan B Success. Success is a two-way street. Not many realize that and keep running hard on the wheel of daily life, doing their job and hoping to succeed someday. Let me tell you that by following this formula, you may make a living but will not find the success that you aspire for in your career, or in your life. Here's a universally acknowledged way of making things happen. Have a vision of the life you aspire for. Chart your path of realization. Plan and then execute. Voila! Your aspirations come true. As simple as it may seem, much goes into this process in terms of breadth and depth to achieve results. Yet, What you find in terms of achievement may fall short of your expectations. I would like to focus on the third point, plan and execute, and share a widely visible but often overlooked ingredient to making things happen. As I said at the beginning, success is a two-way street. Generally, everyone who is out to succeed is so wrapped up in their own definition of success that they are out to do it by themselves and for themselves. This is a very hard way of finding any success and if found, it's very little. True success finds you when you are out to help others succeed. Don't focus on your success but on the success of others. Make it your mission to help others succeed. Your friends, co-workers, associates, team members, partners and clients, in short everyone you interact with or come across. When you make it your agenda to help others succeed, your success happens without really pushing for it or consciously trying. The more people you help succeed, you'll in turn be that much more successful. How positive than this can it get? Change the way you comprehend your success. Your success is not proportional to the amount of effort you exert, but to the effort you expend in helping others succeed. In fact, not even that. It's proportional to the amount of success enjoyed by those that you have helped. Turn around and measure your success with the success you have helped impart to others. Learn to find your success in that of others. Without even your realization, you start to accrue immense success for yourself through the multiplier effect. The best part? You did not have to strive for it. In fact, you would have spent time doing something very fulfilling and gratifying, helping others succeed. Result? You have developed a vastly successful community and your success puts you at the pinnacle of it. So who are you out to help succeed today? I hope you liked that episode and are enjoying all the episodes in Plan B Success Podcast. I'd encourage you to go subscribe on your favorite platform, whether it's any listening platform or YouTube or wherever you listen to podcasts. Make sure you subscribe so that you enjoy this content and extract from it what serves you best, what benefits you in your own life, personal, professional, business, whatever it might be. Plan B. Live is the website where you can go in order to find any episode that you would like to listen to. Three times a week, we release episodes, the first being an inspiring interview with someone who's done it, been there, done that, and can inspire you to go after what you want to achieve. Every Monday, that's the episode that gets released. And then, on Wednesdays and Fridays, We pick a topic and we talk about it in order to benefit you in your personal and professional life. At the same time, if you're someone who's interested in learning more about these concepts, if you're someone who's interested in podcasting as well, go check out planbsuccessschool.thinkific.com. That's where all the online courses are. You can learn and benefit from them there as well. There's a bunch of free courses. There's a bunch of paid courses. Start with the free ones. Get to learn what you aspire to learn 
And if you want to delve deeper, then you can sign up for the other ones. Thank you very much. Thank you.